In the late 18th century, France was on the brink of revolution. A crippling debt, fueled by lavish spending and the costly American Revolution, pushed the nation to the edge. When King Louis XVI attempted to impose new taxes on the already burdened populace, the privileged classes resisted. The ensuing unrest led to the convocation of the Estates General in 1789. The Estates General, a representative assembly, was meant to address the crisis. But it quickly became a battleground. The Third Estate, representing the common people, demanded equal representation. Setting the stage for a dramatic clash, their bold move to form the National Assembly, and the tennis court oath marked a turning point, as they vowed to draft a constitution. Challenging the absolute power of the monarchy, the storming of the Bastille on July 14, 1789, was more than just an attack on a prison. It was a symbolic act of defiance against tyranny. The Bastille, a fortress in prison, had long represented the oppressive nature of the monarchy. Its fall ignited a revolutionary flame that spread throughout France. The National Assembly issued the Declaration of the Rights of Man, and of the Citizen, proclaiming liberty, equality, and fraternity. However, the revolution took a radical turn as the monarchy resisted change. The execution of King Louis XVI in 1793 marked a pivotal moment, but it also ushered in a period of extreme violence and instability. The reign of terror, led by Maximilien Robespierre, was a time of fear and bloodshed as the revolutionaries sought to purge France of its enemies. While it was a necessary evil for some, the excesses of the terror led to Robespierre's downfall. After the reign of terror, France experienced a period of political instability, until Napoleon Bonaparte seized power in a coup d'etat in 1799. Napoleon's rise marked a new chapter in French history, one shaped by the military conflict and military rule. The French Revolution was a watershed moment in world history. It inspired revolutions around the globe, and helped to shape modern concepts of democracy, human rights, and nationalism.